The strong woman is by no means a contemporary invention, and women with willpower have been celebrated for centuries. An ancient Tamil epic provided the inspiration for a dance drama about a pair of remarkable female characters, and it was staged in Durban recently. It was a rainy summer's evening, but that didn't dampen the enthusiasm of local theatre lovers. This was a rare opportunity to enjoy a 2,000-year-old Tamil epic, adapted for the stage by award-winning actor Sivani Chinnapin, who also directed and choreographed the production. Kannagi Kovalin is taken from an ancient Tamil text called the Silapadigar. Growing up, I was exposed to this text and very recently did the inspiration spark to bring this text to stage. The plot revolves around a woman by the name of Kanagi who is married to Kovalin, the son of a wealthy merchant. The character I played in Kanagi Kovalin is Kovalin. He is a very chauvinistic playboy. He enjoys all the attention like all the other guys. Of course, he catches the attention of two beautiful women, and that's Kanegi and Madhavi, and his love interest in both of them. For me, bringing an ancient text to the modern youth can be a bit challenging with the language barrier. So for me, I wanted to use music as a medium, bilingual text, English and in Tamil, so that we can attract the youth as well as convey the message and the story from this ancient text. I played Madhavi. Madhavi is the antagonist in the play. She uses her sexuality and she entices Kovalin to love her. Kovalin wastes his wealth on Madhavi and he ends up penniless before realizing what he has done to himself and his wife. One of the aspects of this entire drama was the language, the other was the music selection. Savani has made some imaginative choices to make the story accessible to a present day audience. The styles of dance that I used is not just Bharatanatyam. I have put in contemporary Bharatanatyam, ballet, South Indian folk dance, hip hop, and tried to bring all these genres together so that we can convey the multi stylistic ability of the cast. The costumes represented the ancient Tamil culture with the Bharatanatyam costume, which we then added a contemporary feel with the pleats and, and the seat. We tried not to make it too ancient Tamil. While the story is ancient, the message remains relevant. This production definitely empowers women. It shows two types of females who are in society, one the wife, the other the mistress. In the Indian culture, that type of relationship is kept hush and silent. And those females who endure the suffering are suffocated by society's pressure. This production aims to bring to light those injustices. It aims to tell the woman who is suppressed, you have a voice and there is somebody who will hear you.